So if you want to go bankrupt, definitely join triathlon. We got the- I'm kind of just chi in this whole race. <laughs> Minero! So I just realized I have no nutrition. Not basic, they're 500 bucks, but. <laughs> there we go, shake it out, shake oh, it out. Shaking out the legs. She's flying. Was that too loud? No, you're good. <laughs> Welcome to Ironman Santa Cruz. All right, as you can see here, we have the water. <laughs> Um, there's a lot of people shaking it out. We have the barriers set up. So this is the bike course and then oh, you got two shakeouts coming up Two shakeouts in the in the distance. So today's Saturday. We were supposed to do a shakeout run yesterday It didn't happen. I was supposed to do a swim start this morning with the team that didn't happen And I'm supposed to do a bike ride at some point, which let's be honest. It's probably not gonna happen <laughs> I'm kind of just chi in this whole race Yeah as you can tell, we're feeling good. The vibes are high. So my projected time is going to be probably a PR somehow. <laughs> we feel good. I'm healthy. My 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 hams are still pretty sore from uh, Barry's boot camp. Dude, honestly, Santa Cruz 70.3 2023 is going to be fucking lit, bro. We got two shakeouts. Let's go. How far are you guys riding? Uh, not far. Not far. Okay, so not far. So they're just shaking it out. Shakeout ride. And then here, we got one more guy coming up. Here we go. He's got gloves too, so he's like extra clean. Just a little shakeout run. Regular, regular run. Right on. Good for you. I know. Who wants to be an Iron Man these days? You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't hear that, did you? All right, we out here in Santa Cruz, California, here for the 70.3 Iron Man. Shake it up. <laughs> so as Livy was saying, this is part of the bike course, it looks like, which is pretty dope. <laughs> okay. This green arrow looks like it's going to be part of the run. Imagine I just peel it off and point it this way. Everyone's all confused. <laughs> Make it like a U-turn or something. Just mess everyone up. But I know the course. So then I just come through first place. <laughs> They're like, how did he win? He was only running like an eight minute pace. Right. Yeah, we're headed over to the, toward the village. You can see more people shaking it out. It's just insane how many people are shaking it out. <laughs> Another one. Sheave two. Shake it out. We have rounded the corner here on the west cliff of Santa Cruz. You can see the swim is going to be out and around that pier. They're gonna come in, they're gonna hit Depot Park, and they're going to depart for their bike ride this way. Steamer Lane Supply. Steamer Lane Supply. Steamer Lane Supply. So we're at breakfast right now. <laughs> Grandma, what are you gonna get? I don't know. She doesn't know. I think right now we're just kind of vibing, we're cruising. I actually hate when people ask me that question, so. No, I mean like for today. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Pre oh, pre-race, yeah. So we were thinking about some kind of shakeout run, shakeout ride, but I think we're gonna scrap that. And we're just gonna go with a burrito. Okay. <laughs> Dude, there's so much shakeout going on right now, my brain is shaking. <laughs> Shake it up, baby! Let's go! Right next to the water. I mean, it's how can you beat it? Uh, today's agenda, you know, usually it's packed with like pre race mindset, pre race meal, pre race this, pre race that. Why don't you just take your pre race plan, shove it up your ass? <laughs> no one touched your muffin. No, I didn't touch your muffin. Oh, so what we have to do before a race, my new race plan right now, kind of got to degaff a little bit. We're doing a little breakfast, no shakeout run, no bike. We're just gonna turn the bike in and I might throw the running shoes on. The only thing I am gonna do is eat an early-ish dinner. And I have also, I just realized I have no nutrition, no Martin's mix, no nothing for the bike, no macro bars. So what am I gonna do for the bike? <laughs> I don't know. Well, I guess they'll have stuff on the course. Yeah, for the run, not for the bike. Maybe I'll put Gatorade in the bottles. I, I, I mean, as you can tell, I'm not prepared for this. Hometown burrito. Oh my God, you guys, look at that. It's like a Crunchwrap Supreme. Yes. One bite, everyone knows it all. Oh my god. In the inside. Mm. Oh my god. Chorizo? So good. Nice. This is your arrow. <laughs> you're gonna keep that empty? Right, so you're yeah. gonna do it. And that's all yeah. you do. But do you yeah. do it full? It. So it, it, no. It's, it's just like, it closes it the space down. It's uncomfortable, but what am I gonna so do? Be on the rods again, and then I'll look, and it's like 4 and 7 miles per hour difference. <laughs> <laughs> Go to check in, check the bikes, and get all our shit. Downtown Santa Cruz, all right here. Now the finish, get down a hill, and then a tight turn in, boom, right there on the sand. Tom will win this race, I'm manifesting it right now. Right. Tom's gonna win this race, and, we're gonna, and then we're gonna cut back to this, we're gonna cut back to this clip, and I'm gonna be like, I told you so. You know, I hate to spoil the ending of this video, but Tom did win the race. Tom's at the special tent. Oh, Ooh, he gets a yellow cat, that, bro. This is the pro table. <laughs> this is probably like the nicest transition area. It's a football, soccer field, or both. I don't know, it's turf though. <laughs> it's bringing me back to my high school glory days, football. Soft, it's warm. 
Makes me want to just take a nap. Might come through transition and just be taking a nap. All right, uh, car is fixed. It was my exhaust. The muffler broke at like where it welds on. So I had to get that re-welded. We're all good now. It doesn't sound like a boat. You're getting ready for your first Iron Man. You got your OGO bag. And you're nervous. What do I do? But fear not because we are chi hooing this whole race. We don't even know what we're doing. I was with, I'm the one that wanted to do this race. Yeah. And then I said, I'm going to sign up. And then so Alex signed up really quickly. And then I was like, oh, I don't know if this is financially like a good move for me right now. And I was like, I'll sign up in like two weeks. Okay, two weeks comes. Olivia didn't sign up. Long story short. <laughs> I'm doing I'm it alone. Actually. You're going to be in a lot of pain. So you're going to need what? Tylenol. Painkillers. Painkillers. Let's do it again. You're going to be in a lot of pain, so you're going to need what? Painkillers. Painkillers. <laughs> I'm going to pop three of these before the swim, because why not? <laughs> <laughs> this, this is your swim cap that you're going to get for an Ironman. You're going to get a bib to put on a little belt that I forgot. Once again, we're chihu the whole thing. This is going to be your timing chip. It's going to go on your left ankle. All right, let's talk race nutrition. Oh, I got my watch, too. All right, so we got two bags of Sour Patch. I'm one Bobo Oat Bar. I've never tried these on the bike, but I should be okay. This is gonna be before the swim. One Stroop Waffle, this uh, Energy Square. As in the bottles, I'm gonna do a little Gatorade. And also, haven't decided if I wanna put some Goo Tabs for sodium, but I am gonna have these Ketone IQs. Ketone IQ, my boy? Ketone IQ. Uh, one in the morning, and then one right before the bike. All right, now, I've got the Roka <laughs> wetsuit, and I haven't used my goggles since Moro Bay, so we're just gonna pray that they're we, good. Our, oh, I got earplugs, uh, too. What's your millimeter? Dude, let's go, bro. Two earplugs, we're dialed. I'm not gonna use the tinted ones. I'm gonna use these semi-tinted ones. Uh, the sun you know what? Tinted. I just don't think those, those oh, these will be perfect. Sick. Oh, but you know what? Okay, that's a good thing. Always test your goggles. Here, these ones. Oh, that's much better. I'm going with the Ow, tint. My yeah, <laughs> Yeah, I'm going with the tint. That'll Check be the out. tint. We got more shakeout. Try kit right here. I'm gonna put that on. Got a heart rate <laughs> monitor. Aero socks, Velotoes Aero socks. And I can't decide if I'm gonna wear the Nike Alpha Flies. <laughs> Or if I'm gonna wear the new on Cloud Boom Echo 3, but we're gonna go do a run right now. I'm gonna test them out. So I just learned too that if you put this in your shirt while you're riding, you're yep. more aerodynamic. Basic bike shoes, not basic, they're 500 bucks, but. <laughs> <laughs> so if you wanna go bankrupt, definitely join triathlon. We got the aero I mean, helmet. You wanna talk aerodynamic. All right, it's supposed to be so foggy tomorrow, so I think I'm gonna leave this thing off. Oh there my we God, go. Really, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. really just clicked on Minero! <laughs> Now you just want to run through everything and make sure you have everything like yeah. I just did. So the only thing I'm missing is the belt. Uh, so just don't overthink it on race day. It's just like put some stuff together and go have fun. You know like when you get a paycheck and then you're like, God, where'd all that money go? The cool thing with triathlon is you never have to wonder. You just look. You're like, oh, there it is. <laughs> Decided, yeah, yeah, we decided we are gonna shake it out. We can't not shake it out. So we're gonna shake it out real quick. <laughs> Aid station, water. My knee kind of hurts. We're like 48 seconds into the run. Oh, dude, that's sick. Look at that. Look at that view we're gonna be running with. <laughs> uh, smile. I used all my energy on. <laughs> all right, I, I don't know how, but I feel really good. I'm just gonna pray I feel like this tomorrow. Let's freaking go. Okay, there you go, the buoys are out. It's time to become an Iron Man. I haven't even looked at the swim. Just go around. <laughs> it's easy, bro, it's one turn. Well, two. All right, here it comes. Let's go, baby. You're in first place. Keep going, keep going. You got it, Rich. <laughs> so I've run a total of 62 miles since Morro Bay. Olivia, a lot of how people many? people might be like, whoa, that's a lot of miles. How... And for Alec, he just told me. 150 a month. Is 150 a month is pretty normal. Yeah. Are you sad you're not doing Santa Cruz now? I'm really sad, but at the same time, I'm very humbled running one mile right now and stopping. I'm like, yeah, I've been up in the gym doing like my hit workouts. Have they been working? Um, Obviously. You come down there and then you rip down right over there. Down, so you come from down over there and then you rip down over there. She's somewhere on this freaking massive pier over there, over there. And then you do a U turn come out of the water you go up dude and you're going dude, over to the seeds where are you at when i need you yeah you have you have fomo dude it's i all right, have straight though. fomo <laughs> i can't make it <laughs> every hundred I'm yards huh i'm not vibing dude it's all right dude. Uh, i'll give you a little context as to what my week's been like i'll start with sunday i had a really big ride monday like 40 or so miles but hard tuesday i don't think i did anything wednesday nothing thursday nothing friday nothing Saturday, which is today, 2.67 mile run. There it is. So pretty much nothing. Um, tomorrow, we're gonna race. <laughs> it's called the Chihu Taper.